Hey everybody, it's Yuri. Today I'm going to be going over my lead uppercut. So for me, I'm right-handed, which means my left is going to be my lead uppercut. So I'm trying to maintain balance. I'm always going to try to make sure my hands are always starting from my cheeks. So the big thing I see that people try to do when they throw an uppercut is they drop their hand to their waist and try to throw it really hard. And that actually exposes you a lot more. As soon as I drop my hand, I'm wide open for a counter, right? So I don't want to try to drop it too low. I want to try to get it just a little bit below my chin and then roll, get that little roll with my shoulder and then use that shoulder to help pop it up. The other big thing is people throw their chin up as they throw their hand. That leaves them really exposed. And then the big hip push. So they'll throw the hips and they'll throw themselves off balance and then you're going to be countered quite easily. So I always want to try to make sure I'm maintaining balance, I'm nice and strong, chin is tucked, and I'm going to do a slight roll and pop my shoulder into it, and I'm aiming my big two knuckles, so I have to turn my hand over and make sure it's nice and strong. So again, just getting that little up and out motion, right, try not to go just straight up, unless you're really close to somebody, I'm going up and out, right, twisting my whole body into it, if you want to add that little power, pop your foot into it, but again, try not to throw yourself forward or backwards as you do it. So stay balanced, get comfortable with just doing that little roll, right? Practice that little roll, popping your shoulder into it, right? And then as you get better with that, just add a little bit more speed and then add a little bit more power if you wanna use your legs, right? Up and out and then back to your face, okay? Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Please leave me a like. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys at the next video.